Year one of the J.R. Eldridge era at Farmington was a success. The Cardinals knocked off two 7A teams and route to an eight-win season, a third-place finish in a competitive 5A West, and a trip to the playoffs. Now the Cardinals want to see what kind of next step they can take in year two under their head coach. Eldridge won two state titles at Arkadelphia, and he's working to bring that championship pedigree to Farmington. He gets back quarterback Cameron Van Zant, a rising junior and one of the best QBs in the state who earned five News Athlete of the Week honors last year after a five-touchdown performance against Prairie Grove. A big weapon for Van Zant returns in senior Peyton Funk, who is also all-conference at receiver. On defense, five all-conference guys return as seniors, including Sam Wells in the secondary, Cooper Garden higher at linebacker, and David Stepmeyer up front. Last season's first-round loss to Whitehall has served to motivate this Farmington team all summer and show them what they have to do to make the jump to the top of the 5A. That starts with the culture Coach Eldridge is implementing. Number one, are, are we making a positive difference in the lives of our teammates? And then number two, are we competing for and winning conference and state championships? I mean, those are the two things that we're going to measure ourselves by every single day. Did we make a difference and are we competing to win? Coach always says never peak, which means we're at a steady upslope during the whole season. Never get to the top. We're still going. Essentially, it's kind of like the Texas thing. I, uh, I feel like we're back. I really do. I feel like we've got a good program in place and I feel like it can build. The action for the Cardinals gets started on August 26th when Farmington is on the road at Greenbrier. The Cardinals then have their home opener the following week against Springdale. And looking ahead to October 21st, a marquee matchup in the new look 5A West as Farmington pays a visit to Shiloh Christian for one of its biggest games of the season.